New reaction tonight as Chief Judge Frank Caprio announces he will be retiring from Providence Municipal Court after nearly 40 years of service. I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Shannon Heggie. The news comes amid increased scrutiny of his popular TV show and its relationship with the city. 12 News reporter Kayla Fish spoke to one of his close friends as well as the leader of one of the state's watchdog groups and joins us with what they're saying tonight. Kayla. Well, first, in terms of the show's future, the judge's brother Joe Caprio wrote on social media that the show will no longer be filming in municipal court now that Frank Caprio is retiring. But there are still questions about what happens next. People are going to miss him. After 38 years as a judge, Frank Caprio is retiring from Providence Municipal Court. Former Mayor Joe Paolino, whom Caprio called a driving force behind his first election as judge in 1985, tells 12 News Caprio brought great stature to the bench as well as notoriety. And whenever you talk to people outside of Rhode Island and even in other parts of the world, and you mentioned you're from Rhode Island, people say, do you know who Judge Caprio is? That fame, the result of the Caught in Providence TV show produced by Caprio's family members inside the court, which boomed in popularity in recent years thanks to a national syndication and viral social media moments. But with a new city council and new leadership came new questions about the show. Earlier this week, the council president asked the city's top lawyer to conduct a review of the show as it relates to ethics rules. The way the court uh, happens is really sort of um, happening to be a TV show uh, that the family is, you know, making what appears to be a large amount of money. John Marion with Common Cause Rhode Island argues even though on the outside the show appears good, it should have never been allowed to happen inside a public courtroom. We don't let other folks profit. Uh, or their families profit off their public office. We just need all public officials to, to meet that standard. Caprio has offered to volunteer on the court and could be given a chief emeritus unpaid title at a council meeting next week when his replacement and other judge seats will be voted on. I'd love to see other cities and towns uh, maybe call upon him to have him do work in other parts of the Rhode Island. Right now, it's unclear whether the city will still conduct a review of the show and its ethical implications, though John Marion tells me he believes that review should still happen in case this type of question ever presents itself again. In studio, I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.